Hello student, welcome to Learn More Maths. Uh, today we are going to solve some more problems from progressions uh, from exercise uh, 6.0. Fifth problem we are solving. See here, find the number of terms in each of the following APs. So here he has given an AP, he is asking to find us the number of terms. How many terms are there in the given AP? So for that, uh, continuing the previous class, uh, we have already solved <coughs> these type of problems. See here, uh, this is the given AP. So, see student, how can we find the number of terms? So, uh, let uh, this is the first term. See here, 18 is the first term and we have to find the common difference. Since it is in AP, so the common difference will be same in, in every successive terms. The difference, uh, so here A is equal to 18 and D is equal to, D is equal to, 15 and a half minus 18. So it will be 31 by 2 minus 18. So 2 15s are 30 plus 1, 31 by 2. So find LCM 31 minus 36 divided by 2. That is minus 5 by 2. So D is equal to minus 5 by 2. So he is asking find the number of terms for that uh, let uh, minus 47 is a n nth term let minus 47 is the nth term so for that uh, see here let a n is equal to minus 47 suppose if it is a 20th term there will, there are 20 terms in the given AP. if it is 30th term there are 30 <coughs> 30 terms in the given AP. So let an is equal to minus 47. But we know in an arithmetic progression the nth term an is equal to what? a plus n minus 1 into d. a plus n minus 1 into d is equal to minus 47. So simply substitute we have a and d values here. Substitute in the formula a is equal to 18 and d is equal to minus 5 by 2. Substitute in the formula. A is equal to, I am substituting A is equal to 18 plus N minus 1. So, right as usual, we have to find the N value. So, N minus 1 into D is minus 5 by 2 is equal to how much? Minus 47. Minus 47. <coughs> to find the N value, take 18 to the right side. Here we can get a minus 5 by 2 into N minus 1 is equal to minus 47 again plus 18 becomes minus 18 so write as usual this term minus 5 by 2 into n minus 1 is equal to minus 47 minus 18 we can get minus 65 minus 65 so n minus both the <coughs> so cancel negative symbol on both sides so we can get here n minus 1 is equal to 65 into take 5 by 2 to the right side it becomes 2 by 5 2 by 5 so 5 ones and 5 13 are 65 13 fives are 65 so 13 into 2 is equal to 26 n minus 1 is equal to 26 therefore n is equal to 26 plus 1 that is 27 therefore there are 27 terms in the given AP Therefore, we can write, therefore, there are 27 terms. How many terms? 27 terms in the given AP. So, there are 27 terms in the given AP. So, like this, we can find the number of terms or the nth term in the given AP using the formula a n is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d. So, that's all today's class student. To get latest updates, subscribe to my channel, learn more math by work.